amelea wengi ambao wako hapa viongozi wote ambao wameongea wametuambia na hakuna mmoja wao ambaye hana story moja ama ingine ya vile maisha yake yaliguzwa na huyo kinara wetu mzee Moi hata mimi siwezi kuwa nimefika pahali nimefika bila mawazo yake bila mapenzi yake na ametulea wengine wetu kutoka wakati bado tulikuwa shule na alitulea kama watoto wake Mzee Moi was a man who had great strength of character great patience Mzee Moi had that strength that comes from humility Mzee Moi respected everybody na vile tumesikia pia na ni kweli mzee moyo alikuwa na marafiki katika viwango mbali mbali ya society yetu ya Kenya in every branch hata huko kwetu katundu akija kulikuwa watu walikuwa najua na alikuwa anaita kwa nini mzee fulani hayuko hapa kwa nini mzee fulani ako wapi anafanya nini he knew people at all levels of society all levels of society And let me say on towards because mimi wengi wameongea mimi sitaki kuongea sitaki kuongea mengi yote ambaye anatakikana kusemwa has been said but truly moi was a father to this country he was a father to many of us And the one thing I would want to remind people today ni kwamba heshima sio utumwa. <clears throat> Mzee Moi alikuwa mtu wa heshima. Alitumikia mzee wangu miaka kumi na saba kwa heshima kubwa sana. Sana. mpaka wakati wake ukafika akaendelea kuongoza wa Kenya kwa heshima kwa miaka 24 na akawacha na heshima akakuwa heshima akakuwa na heshima na yule ambaye alimfuatilia hata kama haikuwa choice yake akakuwa na heshima na mzee Mwai Kibaki wakati mimi nilichukua usukani mwaka wa 2013 nilikuwa na shida sana kuja hapa kwa sababu mzee lazima nikiingia asimame aseme karibu mheshimiwa rais sasa ndio namwambia mzee ke hapana hapana siwezi siwezi hivyo sivyo mambo inaenda sasa wewe ndio uko na serikali wewe ndiyo kiongozi hata mimi lazima niko heshima wenzangu uongozi nitapata hamna shida lakini tafadhali tafuteni heshima na wenzenu tuishi kwa heshima the arrogance that we see in today's leadership raises many questions as to the future of this country it does and i would plead with all my fellow leaders hakuna mtu mkubwa mdogo kushinda mwenzake 
Hakuna mtu ambaye hana nafasi ya cheo kwa sababu hiyo nafasi inapeanwa na Mwenyezi Mungu kupitia wananchi wa Jamhuri ya Kenya. Kwa hivyo hata ukitukana nani namna gani? Hata ukifanya nini kwa nani? Hata ukiwa na hasira ya aina gani? Hiyo haitasaidia. Lakini heshima na unyenyekevu na utulivu wako Mwenyezi Mungu atakuonea. Kwa hivyo mimi nimalizie kwa kusema tuko hapa kwa furaha tukikumbuka mzee baba yetu mzee Moi tuko hapa tena kujikumbusha na vile Moses Batangula amesema hapa it's good to remind ourselves of where we have come from the journey we have traveled in order for us to be able to have a very clear idea of the journey that is yet to come this is important yangu mimi ni kuwauliza wote na wakenya wenzangu tujifahamu pahali ambapo tumetoka pahali ambapo tuko na tujiulize pamoja ni pahali gani tuataka kuona taifa letu la Kenya nilisema juzi hata nchi kuna historia kulikuwa wale nilisema wakati nilikuwa kule sagana kulikuwa wale ambao walijitolea kwa sababu walikuwa wanaamini walijitolea maisha yao mali yao na hata uhuru ule ambao walikuwa wanapigania hawakuona hawakuona but they were led by principle they were led by a cause they were led by justice kukakuja wengine wakachukulia na hawa pia wakaendelea mpaka taifa ikapata uhuru na Mwenyezi Mungu akawaonekea na wakaongoza kwa vyeo mbali mbali hawa wakaweka pia msingi wao kama at- wale wa mbele yao ambao hawakuona huo uhuru wakaweka kukakuja vijana wa wakati hiyo wakina mzee Moi wakakuja na wakachukulia na hawa pia wakajenga kukakuja wale wengine ambao pia waliweka kosi yao katika hiyo nyumba tunaita Kenya mpaka ikakuja marika yetu na tumeweka yetu na sisi tutawachilia tuweke wengine wakuja na waongeze so that our house call Kenya standing on a firm foundation continues to grow and prosper wenzangu tusiteleze tulete demolition squad badala ya wajenzi Mungu awabariki na Mungu awalinde Asante sana We are we are deeply grateful your excellency sir for your and likwana nilikuwa nilikuwa nimekuja na 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 I don't know si eh ukumbusho eh ambaye hii kitinda mimba anasema ni kwake lakini ni kwa mzee <laughs> ningependa nipatie mzee wa hii nyumba inaitwa nyumba ya moi <laughs> atakuonesha baadaye wewe god bless you
we are deeply grateful, Your Excellency, sir, for your fatherly advice to the family and the nation. I would now like to invite Honorable Senator Gideon Moy to move a vote of thanks. Welcome, sir. Asante sana, Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, Your Excellency Kalonzo Musyoka, Your Excellency Musalem Dawadi, uh, Party Leader Senator, and my colleague Senator Weta Wetangula. All elected members who are here who are with us today the governors, the senators, the members of parliament, and all guests who have come today, including my people, my clan of uh, Kapchap Keres, and my mom's people, uh, Kap Bomet, who are people. Um, but my job is very easy and very um, welcoming in the sense that I'm just standing here today to say thank you. And before I continue, I just want to tell uh, uh, Rice Kwamba, Najwa Sisi, kila mutu iko mila yake. Vile weta lisema, mzea wakona sumzanga na yoi mambo ya mila. Sisi ni wa Kalenjin. Kalenjin ato toona ili watu wote ambao wako huko, ni wa Kalenjin pure. Na tunafatanga mila zetu. So kweli hapa, kabarak ni boma ya mzee. Dugu yangu mkubwa meseme ukweli. Ni boma ya mzee ambayo mimi ni natawala. Mila. So, today, I want to say a huge, on behalf of the Moy family, a huge thank you to each and every one of you who has come today. I know it was a very quiet um, event, and we had decided as a family that today was just a day when we wanted to call our members of our clan and members of the extended families to be with us here because they didn't get a chance one year ago. Because one year ago, it was a state function, and this year we said, let's just be just the family. But as you know, these things are overtaken, <laughs> events are overtaken by the will of the people. So it reached a stage still I kept quiet, but people were just saying, no, they have to come, no, they have to be present. And we said, okay, let it be. Um, I got calls, which I registered all of, them, all of them, of over 187 members of parliament who called me personally, and they come from all sides of the divide, but just to appreciate Mze, and they had asked that they would like to be present. But I said it was a quiet event, and there'll be a time when uh, we will have that uh, opportunity. So I'd like to thank them and all those who have called us, those from Kenya, those from outside Kenya, would like to say thank you. We received even a call personally from His Excellency um, Seveni, knowing about uh, this day, His Excellency uh, Salva Kir. The two friends of Mze called to remember Mze on this day. So. I know people want to have their lunch, so I just want to name a few people we'd like to just really say uh, thank you as a family. Um, all of you who are here, all those who made this possible, all those who've rendered their services at no cost at all, but just for the love of Mze to make sure this has gone seamless. Those who've come far and wide, Karim all the way, our member of parliament from Garissa, left his functions there to come all the way uh, to be with us, Asante Sana, Mishimiya. And a member who's been voted by the NCIC as a Prince of Peace. Yeah, yeah. 
something might rub off. <laughs> Thank you. you will train him. Thank you. Um, you've seen when Zay is now a mom arresting those who made it uh, possible. We've got a builder with us called RG. RG is here with us. His, his father was with Mze. His father passed on. He continued with the job. And he's the one together with Jojo and some people who came from Italy who helped us just to have the concept. And it was led by my wife, Mama uh, Aboma <laughs> Sasa. Zara, uh, then we want to thank you for your time and effortless, including Eunice, who was uh, instrumental as Sylvia, and the wife of our head of our family, uh, Susan uh, Moy. We want to thank you so much for everything that uh, you've done. Susan is one actually who made sure today has taken place. So we want to thank you. Uh, very much uh, for that. Um, if I minor to us to Nasamanga Senator Asante, those who drive, one number one, a good and a gari, Ilengon, the Malulana, Zuko, Uko, Boma, they are white cows, Charolais from France. And if I minor, the breeder, he brought them from France, Nakakuja, New Kopatia, Muse. Is a long time by Zimeza, Zimeza, and a fantastic breed. We thank you. And I remember uh, your race. Nilenda Nikamuliza, if I'm Senator Kwamba, Tafadali, Mpatia Mze, Suyata, Minu Nyonya, and Ayo Macho. Akineleza, we we, Mtokupiga B. So I remember that. But we thank you. And we thank you for the friendship you had with, uh, with Mze. And all these leaders who are here, Kalonzo, Nsioku, we were together, Your Excellency. Thank you for your friendship. Weta, thank you for your friendship. And thank you, Kukua Wakili, Philip. Asante sana. Musalia. Musalia Mdavadi. Thank you. Musalia, we've practically grown up uh, together. We've grown up in the same uh, bomber with um, Salia Tang Tukwe Ututuetu. Um, Pete Walsh Gunuga, Kongwe, Kongwe Gobwa, Kongwe Gobwa, Kena Kuba, Kongwe Abisa Kuberu Rakchova, Kongwe Tang Tage Galali Alechi Chage, Badai and Mutai, Amukibi Royoi, Ketar. Uh, um, to which Bishops, for your prayers for holding us through this one year. Death is, when it comes to your home and comes a calling, it's extremely difficult. And it's extremely difficult if you're alone. As the Moy family, the last one year, we've been blessed with friends like you. We've been blessed that you've been there with us. You've held our hands. We've had prayer meetings uh, together. You've chaperoned us through life. Your Excellency, you've been one of them, one of their team. And I just want to say to all of you, the ones who are here and not here, thank you for being with us this last uh, one year. Thank you for holding our hands. Thank you for your prayers. We sincerely and deeply, deeply appreciate all that you've done uh, for us. So those few remarks, I know there'll be lunch now. Um, Governor Waititu, Karibu. Karibu Zana, Karibu Nimbani. Um, with those few remarks, God bless you all. Thank you so much. Still keep us in our prayers. God bless you. Asanteni, thank you. Um, thank you very much, Senator Gideon Moy, for the